Welcome to the YouTube session of NDTV and uh, what we are reporting right now is that Pakistan has confirmed that they had blocked Twitter or the platform X as it is known since mid-February and uh, this was confirmed in a hearing, in a court hearing in Sindh High Court. Uh, the authorities informed that they had suspended Twitter's operation in the country since mid-Feb uh, and they have owed it to the national security issues. Uh, I'll just quote of what what has happened, how it came up for hearing in the uh, Sindh High Court in Pakistan, what did the court say, what did the, how did the authorities defended it, uh, defend it, and uh, why it was banned. So there are three, four points for this story, that why Twitter was banned, what did the court say, whether the court has asked them to restore the ban or not, and uh, how it has become also, how did the court observe that it has met Pakistan in laughing stock across the globe. So let's come to the first part of this story. In a petition, uh, while hearing multiple petitions in the Sindh High Court, where people had uh, objected that how the operations of the platform X or Twitter has been facing issues in Pakistan, the Pakistan's Interior Ministry has admitted that they had suspended the Twitter's operations since mid-Feb. And uh, as per the Reuters report, it said that uh, the Pakistan's Interior Ministry submitted in the court that it is very pertinent to mention here that the failure of Twitter to adhere to the lawful directives of the government of Pakistan and address concerns regarding the misuse of its platform necessitated the imposition of a ban. So this was submitted by the Pakistan government in the Sindh High Court, after which the court came down heavily on the interior ministry saying that what are you going to achieve by this? This will rather make us a laughing stock in front of the globe. Uh, the ministry sort of alleged that, uh, that the decision to impose this ban was made in the interest of national security of Pakistan and uh, which which was intended to intended to maintain public order, impose security, as well as preserve integrity of the nation. So these were the submissions made by the Interior Ministry of the Pakistan. Uh, while Chief Justice Akhil Ahmed Abbasi from the Sindh High Court pulled up the government, saying that you have made us a laughing stock, and also ordered the restoration of this uh, Twitter platform within one week. Now, since mid Feb, uh, while Imran Khan had alleged the rigging in elections, its supporters and multiple people had highlighted that how Twitter was getting inaccessible in Pakistan. So multiple petitions were filed in the High Court, after which the Sindh High Court was hearing this uh, petition and while uh, hearing the petition, the Interior Ministry of Pakistan made this submission that you do maintain peace and security in the state, uh, in the state of Pakistan. They had imposed the ban on Twitter and this ban had been going on for the, uh, for the last two, three months since mid-Feb. Uh, we know that how uh, Imran Khan was put on the jit, under, uh, behind the bars and he also carried out his campaign or his uh, his supporters carried out the election campaign. Uh, they were using social media. Multiple uh, rallies and gatherings were held in Pakistan during the election season and, and it was all being done with the help of social media. Now, this is one part of the story that how the High Court came down heavily in Pakistan's interior ministry and I'll just quote out that what uh, the Chief Justice Akhil Ahmed Abbasi said in his comments and while hearing multiple petitions on the issue, he said, what are you achieving via shutting down trivial things? The world must laugh at us. So this was a comment uh, by the Chief Justice of the Sin High Court while hearing this petition. Now, this also brings us our attention closer to the point that how different governments, even in India, in Pakistan, and different other governments have been at loggerheads with the social media platform X, that whether they're interfering with the internal security or the law and order issues of the country, or they're not complying with the laws. Here, uh, we know that how Facebook and Twitter were also pulled up for not complying with the laws of the Indian government. And later, uh, the Twitter officials, the Facebook officials were also summoned by the Information and Technology Ministry in India. Uh, we also know that many social media platforms have been accused in the past of interfering during the elections, after the elections, or as well as for uh, uh, influencing the opinion of the voters. So the role of social media during the elections is a, is a major concern, not only for the local residents of any country, but for governments, but for social media. But the critics also talk about that how it is one way or the other to control the social media. And the recent addition is the community notes or the fact-checking uh, thing which has been introduced by the platform X or, or Twitter. So uh, this is one aspect of this story, that how Pakistan government uh, banned social media, Twitter or X since mid-February February when the elections were going on 
uh, the Imran Khan, the leader of the op- uh, one of the uh, leader of the opposition there, he was put behind the bars. His supporters and his party kept alleging that the rigging had happened in the elections, and they were trying to garner support uh, or mobilize their supporters and voters through the social media. But uh, it has now been submitted uh, in the court by the Interior Ministry that how they banned the use of social media since mid-Feb, fearing that it will hamper their national security and peace in the nation. And now the High Court in Sindh has asked the Pakistan's Interior Ministry or the Pakistan government to restore Twitter or the platform X within one week. So we'll have to see that when and how does that happen. But that comment of the High Court that the world must laugh on us or should laugh on us for what we have done. So this was how the Sindh High Court pulled up the Pakistan government for banning social media. Uh, we'll see that how Pakistan government reacts to that Sindh High Court, whether they go to the Supreme Court to challenge it or not, or whether the social media platform X will be restored within one week as per the board's order.